What's in a name? Well, apparently something. Some changes are in the works for a couple of streets, not all that far from Lambeau Field. That's right. Both streets have a Green Bay Packers connection. And Fox 11's Eric Peterson is near Ashland Avenue and Lombardi Avenue. Now that's one of the locations that could see a name change. Eric? Good evening, Michelle. Now, it's one of the busiest intersections in town, and it's just a few blocks east of Lambeau Field. Now, right now, cars are able to turn onto Ashland Avenue, but soon they might be turning onto what's called McCarthy Way, named after Packers head coach Mike McCarthy. Now, just to give you an idea of the area we're talking about, Ashland Avenue stretches about six miles from US 41 in De Pere until it ends on Green Bay's northwest side. Now, Green Bay Mayor Schmidt introduced the idea after the Packers won the Super Bowl in 2011. Now, Schmidt wants to honor the coach by naming a street near the stadium district. The Department of Transportation says it's on board with the change, but because Ashland Avenue runs through De Pere, Ashwaubenon, and Green Bay, all three municipalities must pass an identical resolution approving the change. Green Bay's mayor says Ashland Avenue is a good fit. There are people who will want to have businesses there and they're going to want to invest in those areas and, and that's going to do well for all three municipalities. So we're excited about the, the opportunity on this. Now just around the corner, Bart Star Drive is about to get a little longer today. Green Bay Street was originally dedicated in 2005, but it only stretched a couple of blocks south of Lombardi Avenue. Now the street will extend to the south into Ashwaubenon and connect with Potts Avenue. Now the Packers living legend Bart Starr attended a ceremony this morning in his honor. Leaders hope expanding the road will expand development in the area. It's also part of the Walk of Legends project in the stadium district. Officials say the new road is an example of Green Bay and Ashwaubenon working together to have uh, that sort of namesake in our stadium district is absolutely wonderful for both of our communities and to have the stadium district have a main corridor opened up that can attract business will, will help us economically in our, in our region. Now Ashwaubenon leaders say one business has already agreed to move into the area in that uh, part of the stadium district. As far as changing Ashland Avenue to McCarthy Way, city leaders hope to have a plan finalized by August, right around training camp. Coming up at 9, we'll tell you what some businesses along Ashland Avenue think of the possible change. Reporting live in Green Bay, Eric Peterson, Fox 11 News.